a series of conversations with some of the leading nutritionists, uh, they sort of highlighted recently that they didn't know that they only recently themselves discovered that soil health really has a dramatic implication on the amount of, uh, of the nutrition in crops. So here are people that are leading experts in their field, digging it in like had the blinding flash of the obvious that to some degree we've known all we've known for some time that if you improve soil health, you improve nutrition of crops. So oddly, there are a lot of the recognition in in some of these industries that they can apply Silicon Valley like innovation to really take on challenges is, is sort of staring it in the face and um, oddly not thought about because it seems too distant. Anyway. Yeah. Well, part of what it sounds like I Select is built to do is to improve health outcomes by way of food and ag. But where did that where did that drive to improve health outcomes come from? Was it just sort of this obvious thing like of course we should be doing this or or was it something else? Well, I think that system from a standpoint of at, at one level, our obligation to our investors is to give them a great return. So we want to be in deep markets. So we spend 1.9 trillion on the healthcare costs of, of poor nutrition in the United States. That's growing. It's diabetes is a large portion of that. Cardiovascular disease, a bunch of it. But you know, a bunch of things are driving that global trend. Um, you know, U.S. exports many things. One of this global trends like that. Um, and so it's a big market. And so it's a big market with a friction that's a good place to invest. Uh, it's a systems problem. And so it's intriguing intellectually in that uh, errors made in one area are causing costs in another area. Uh, and it's a fascinating part of just sort of humanity. It, you know, the, we are in a period the, of biology. Uh, late 90s was the era of computers. We're now in in an era of biology in which we're really CRISPR and, and other technologies. So it's fascinating. So it's a big problem with the market, with a fascinating problem, and it has an element of humanity to it in terms of, you know, if, if you can live longer than great grandma and great granddad, granddad, grandma, mom and dad, and kids, children, and such, 